Ever wondered about the largest fish in the world? It's a question that piques the curiosity of many. When we think about the vast oceans, we often imagine colossal creatures, creatures that defy our understanding of size and scale. And in this mammoth underwater world, two fish stand out in terms of sheer size, the whale shark and the basking shark. These gentle giants hold the record for the largest fish, not just in terms of weight, but also in length. The whale shark can grow up to a staggering 12.7 meters in length and weigh a whopping 21.5 tons. Its close competitor, the basking shark, isn't too far behind. But these two are just the tip of the iceberg. The underwater world is teeming with giant fish, each with its own unique characteristics and fascinating tales. So are you ready to dive into this intriguing world? Stay tuned as we dive deeper into the fascinating world of these gigantic aquatic creatures. The whale shark, the largest living cartilaginous fish, is an oceanic marvel. Just imagine a creature that can grow up to a staggering 41 and a half feet in length and tip the scales at an immense 47,000 pounds. That's about as long as a school bus and as heavy as four African elephants. This gargantuan creature is none other than the whale shark. Despite its intimidating size, the whale shark is a docile creature, often referred to as the gentle giant of the sea. Unlike their namesake, the terrestrial whale, whale sharks are not mammals but fish, and are in fact the largest fish that currently exists. Now, you might be thinking, such a behemoth must have a monstrous diet to match. But here's the twist. Whale sharks are filter feeders. That means they open their wide mouths to engulf large quantities of water which they then filter for their food, primarily plankton and small fish. So they're not the daunting predators one might expect, but peaceful grazers of the ocean. As for their habitat, whale sharks are found in warm tropical oceans around the globe. They are pelagic, which means they live in the open ocean, but they also often come near the coast, especially during their feeding season. Whale sharks are known to migrate thousands of miles in search of food a testament to their incredible endurance. Yet, despite their massive size and widespread distribution, whale sharks remain elusive and mysterious, a testament to the vast, unexplored wilderness that our oceans still represent. They are listed as endangered by the International Union for Conservation of Nature, with their population sadly decreasing due to human activities. So the whale shark is indeed a gentle giant, but there's more to the story of large fish, Next in line is the basking shark, another fascinating specimen. Now don't let the term basking fool you. This creature isn't just lounging around in the sun all day. The basking shark is the second largest fish species in our oceans, falling only behind the whale shark. This colossal creature can grow up to almost 10 meters in length. That's nearly the size of a school bus. And while its size is certainly impressive, what's truly unique about the basking shark is its feeding habits. Unlike many of its shark brethren, the basking shark is a filter feeder. That's right, this enormous oceanic titan sustains itself by consuming the tiniest creatures in the sea plankton. Much like its larger cousin, the whale shark, the basking shark has developed a unique filtering system to feed. It swims with its massive mouth wide open, taking in huge volumes of water filled with its microscopic prey. The water is then expelled through its gills while the plankton gets trapped in the shark's gill rakers to be swallowed. It's a fascinating spectacle of nature, illustrating the interdependence of the smallest and the largest creatures in our oceans. Despite its massive size and fearsome appearance, the basking shark is a gentle giant. It poses no threat to humans and is known to be quite docile. But unfortunately, like many other large marine creatures, it faces threats from human activities such as fishing and shipping. The basking shark is a marvel of the marine world. Its size, feeding habits, and unique filtering systems set it apart from other species. It's a testament to the diversity of life in our oceans, reminding us of the wonders that lie beneath the waves, and the importance of preserving these ecosystems for future generations. That's the basking shark for you, a marine marvel second only to the whale shark. Now, let's turn our attention to the heaviest bony fish, the sunfish. This aquatic heavyweight is a true marvel of the marine world, boasting a weight record of 2,744 kilograms. That's the equivalent of an adult male African elephant. Imagine an elephant-sized creature gracefully gliding through the ocean depths. That's the sunfish for you. 
The sunfish, also known as the mola mola, is not just famous for its size. It's a unique specimen in the fish kingdom, sporting an unusual shape that's a sight to behold. It looks like a fish head with a tail, or a giant floating disc, if you will. This peculiar shape is a result of its back fin, which never grows after birth, but instead folds into itself, creating a rounded rudder called a clavis. But it's not all about looks with the sunfish. This marine heavyweight has a diet as impressive as its size. From jellyfish to small fish and even zooplankton, the sunfish is not a picky eater. It's an opportunistic feeder, taking advantage of whatever the ocean buffet offers. And speaking of the ocean, it's the sunfish's vast playground. These creatures are found in temperate and tropical oceans worldwide. They're known to bask in the sun near the surface when not feeding, which is how they got their name. But don't be fooled by their peaceful, sunbathing demeanor. These creatures can dive deep into the ocean up to 2,000 feet in search of food. So the sunfish is a true heavyweight in the aquatic world. But what about the longest bony fish? The title of the longest bony fish goes to the giant oarfish. Now this is a creature that truly lives up to its name. It's not just giant for the sake of sounding impressive. It is genuinely, indisputably, incredibly long. We're talking about a fish that can grow up to 45 feet. That's roughly the length of a school bus. Imagine seeing a fish that size swimming alongside your boat. The giant oarfish is a deep sea dweller, spending most of its life in the ocean's twilight zone, a place where sunlight barely reaches and pressure is immense. It's not an environment where most creatures could survive, but the giant oarfish thrives. This watery world is its home, and it's perfectly adapted to life there. Despite its colossal size, the giant oarfish isn't a predator. It's a gentle giant feeding mainly on tiny plankton, small fish, and squid. It's a filter feeder, meaning it gulps in water and filters out its food, rather than hunting and capturing its meals. The body of the giant oarfish is slender and elongated, a silver ribbon that shimmers and glides through the ocean depths. It's a sight to behold, but not many people have had the privilege. These fish are elusive, seldom seen by human eyes. Most of our knowledge about them comes from specimens that have washed ashore or been accidentally caught in fishing nets. What's fascinating about the giant oarfish is its ability to move in a vertical position, unlike most fish that swim horizontally. This unique movement combined with its long, ribbon-like body gives it an almost serpentine appearance. It's no wonder that many believe this creature to be the inspiration behind ancient sea serpent legends. So, there you have it. The longest bony fish in the world is not a fearsome predator but a gentle, elusive giant that spends its life in the dark depths of the ocean, far from human sight. A creature of mystery and intrigue, a living testament to the wonders that lie beneath the sea's surface. That's the giant oarfish a lengthy and elusive creature of the deep. Last but not least, we have the coelacanth, the largest living lobe-finned fish. Picture this, a fish weighing in at an average of 80 kilograms and reaching up to 2 meters long. But the coelacanth isn't just any fish, it's a lobe-finned fish, a group of fish characterized by their fleshy, lobed-paired fins. These fins are unique in that they're jointed, much like our arms and legs and are thought to be the predecessors of the limbs of tetrapods or four-legged vertebrates. Yes, you heard that right. The coelacanth could be considered a distant relative of yours. But the coelacanth's claim to fame doesn't stop at being the largest living lobe-finned fish. Oh no, this fish is also known as a living fossil. Why you ask? Well, it's because the coelacanth, as a species, has been around for an incredibly long time. We're talking about hundreds of millions of years with the first coelacanth fossil dating back to the Devonian period over 300 million years ago. To put that into perspective, that's way before dinosaurs roamed the Earth. Despite their ancient lineage, coelacanths were thought to have gone extinct around 65 million years ago, along with the dinosaurs. But in a twist worthy of a Hollywood movie, a live coelacanth was found off the coast of South Africa in 1938, stunning the world and proving that this extinct fish was very much alive and kicking. But don't get your hopes up about spotting one on your next fishing trip. These elusive creatures prefer to stay in deep caves below the ocean surface, away from prying eyes. And despite their size, coelacanths are not apex predators. They mainly feed on smaller fish and cephalopods moving slowly and deliberately through the water a gentle giant in an underwater world. There you have it, the coelacanth, a fish that's a living testament to the past. As we've journeyed through the world of large fish, 
we've discovered some truly remarkable creatures. Each holds a unique place in the grand scheme of our planet's ecosystems, from the whale shark, the largest living cartilaginous fish, to the colossal basking shark. We've seen the whale shark, a gentle giant that can grow up to a staggering 12.7 meters in length and weigh as much as 21 and a half tons. This magnificent creature gracefully navigates the ocean depths, showing us that size and gentleness can indeed coexist. The basking shark, the second largest, is not far behind in size. Its presence in our waters is a testament to the diversity and richness of marine life. We've delved into the world of bony fish and discovered the southern sunfish, the heaviest of its kind. This fish, with its unique shape and behavior, holds the record at a hefty 2,744 kilograms. Then there's the giant oarfish, the longest bony fish, reaching up to an astonishing 13.7 meters. It's a living testament to the marvels that lie beneath the surface of our oceans. And let's not forget the coelacanth, the largest living lobe-finned fish with an average weight of 80 kilograms and a maximum length of 2 meters. A relic from the past, it serves as a reminder of the rich evolutionary history of marine life. These giants of the deep remind us of the wonders of the aquatic world and the importance of preserving these ecosystems for future generations.